Hello my friends and welcome back to Battletech Zai, it's episode 38. It is time to settle a grudge. Now, who do I want to replace? Decisions, decisions. This is actually a hot environment, so... My hunchback is probably the, not the most appropriate mech to bring to a hot environment. But man, is it packing way more firepower. Let's replace the Fat Panther. I want that initiative bonus. Let's just hope it applies to the whole... It should apply to the whole lens. Let's hope it applies to the whole lens. If it doesn't apply to the whole lance, it's going back in storage and I will free up those extra two tons for uh, equipment. Because, you know, if it, if it only affects the mech that it's equipped to, then, uh, then it's potentially useful for heavies and assaults who want to get that little bit of initiative edge and for whom two tons is not the biggest deal, weight-wise. Let's rumble. Command interface initiated. Here we go. <clears throat> Roger. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. Standing by. I copy. Waiting for orders. Location confirmed. Huh. No, oh, it only affects the mech it's equipped to. Well, that's kind of a waste. Delay. Okay. Let's see what happens. Still a useful item, but more useful for uh, for a heavy or something. Commander. Well, I suppose that frees up two tons for doing something else. I got a sensor tray. Engaging jump jets. Receiving you. Firing jump jets. I copy. Okay. That really is a bit unfortunate. Yes, boss. I'm picking up a new sensor trace. Looks like enemy reinforcements. Wow, well, now that's unpleasant. Go. Taking the shot. 
Nice hits. Ooh, he took a lot of punishment there. Looks like he took a medium laser to the face. Got um. All weapons committed. That's all the crab. Damn, they keep hitting me in the left arm. Ready for orders. Up high. Uh, maybe I can just blast him. Nice. That hit something good. I was not. Oh, he died. Nice. I was not expecting two lances, but okay. Apparently, I've got to deal with two lances. As it stands, this is not a good shot. Copy that. So we'll wait until the enemy gets a little bit closer. The focus fire on my arm is real. Well, that is a side shot, though. The other shots were not side shots, but that one was. Okay, that'll do. Let them come. I copy. I might have to give up the high ground here and like move here or something. Somewhere where I can start focusing these guys down because this is a murder ball here. The AI does not normally have such a tight concentration of units. Ah, I see that this, uh... Yes, Commander. Turkey has decided to be my next victim. This is not exactly a great shot either, but the Locust is not very powerful, so... Giving him everything I've got. Even a small amount of hits could be very serious. Forty-three and forty-eight. 
and I can improve it. Oh, good hits! Enemy destroyed. Good, that's one less evasion stripper. Pointless. It's not a good shot. Gotta bide my time and pick my targets. This is still a lot of metal. Hmm, that crab is actually quite vulnerable. Good to go. It's in the minerals. That's going to provide it with some level of defense. 63 if I fire indirectly. If I move, 58. Okay. Oh wow, I landed almost every missile there. <clears throat> okay. Go! Nice hits. I had some seriously minor damage. Yes, Commander. It's not a bad shot. Think I can punch a hole in this idiot? Maybe next turn I can knock him on his ass. And then end him. Well, so far so good. They're doing very, very, very little damage to me. Standing by. They are definitely paying for every inch. a lot of enemies here that are actually really vulnerable now that have exposed themselves they love to stand in those minerals but you know it damages their chance to hit yes commander so I'm often not sure how I feel about it. Target acquired. Waiting for orders. Finish him. Ooh, he's still with us. Critical hit, Commander. Okay. 
We'll be good. We'll be fine. I might have to cycle some of my guys around as the battle develops. He aimed for Fight Club and he managed to laser my uh, missile boat twice in the arm. What's up, boss? All weapons are go. Thunderbirds are go. Oh, right, that actually hurt me a fair bit. And of course, the uh, Trebuchet 2.0 here has a much better design with more ammunition. And a missile targeting computer just to continue to salt your injuries for you. Okay. Crap cakes for dinner. That was quite a nasty hit there. What on earth is that? Okay. What's up, boss? Here we go. I think the time has come to try and get behind them. Try and cause them some uh, some issues with angling. Still a lot of metal on the field here. One, two, three, four, five. You know, it's one of these funny things. If they were using stock mechs, then I wouldn't consider them to be much of a threat. But since they've all, more or less, all got, uh, you know, designs that, that players would I'll just wait here until would make and would utilize, then you have to take them just that little bit more seriously. Is standing by really starting to take some punishment now hi <laughs> I love the AC too it's a great piece of kit and I actually can say that not sarcastically in this mod. Why? Pretty sure that there are juicier targets to shoot at. Especially considering that guy's uh, missile capacity. He's actually quite the nice little uh, LRM vomit, vomiter, vomit machine. <laughs> I'm all in the minerals. Man, that's a bad shot. It's just like an awkward position. Oh, 
watch my six. It's behind me. You do realize that by doing that, you have now positioned yourself in such a way that I can get behind you. Receiving you. Engaging jump jets. All weapons committed. Go. Vindicators are not known for their armor. Although this one is actually reasonably tough. Waiting for orders. Roger that. Firing all weapons. Oh, nasty. Inflicted some heavy damage. Good to go. Man, he took the full. He took the full hit there. Lifting off. Hi guys. Here it comes. So of course he's actually got slightly improved rear armor, I think. Yes, Commander. I can't get the, the position of my desire without jumping for it. On the move. I don't want to jump. Locking on target. Ooh, another headshot. I think the first one was injury ignored. Commander. Wait up there, out of the way. He's got a fair amount of heat sinks, so he can just cool down. The idea is to create a surround so that the AI doesn't know which direction to face. Eyes. I saw two shots miss and I thought, oh, this is going to be a bad, this is going to be a bad shot. And then the next three went straight into the RCT and I was just like, yeah. I will see you in the next life. Ready for orders. All these desert biome battles, they really don't suit my uh, my mech designs, but you know. The desert doesn't really benefit anybody. Receiving you. Roger that. Another headshot. God damn. It's like this, uh, his cockpit's got a great big magnet in it that attracts SRMs. Oh, 
Uh, okay. Should be hitting this side now. Orders. Here it comes. Go. Oh, the pilot died. <laughs> Hostile eliminated. Too many, too many terrible, mind-altering injuries. Nice. I've never loved the blackjack so much. <laughs> uh, I feel like the blackjack is almost meta for this mod. Like now, now all I want is uh, is a team of blackjacks. That's uh, that's my desire. It's just nothing but blackjacks. Ready for orders. Ah, uh, yes. This is your daily reminder that I am indeed behind you. Oof. Oh, yeah. It's on. It's go time. Commander. Oh, that was some bad shooting. Oh well. Good to go. Hi, buddy. I'm still behind you. Just wanted to remind you. On your day. Critical hit, Commander. Well, there goes his missile launcher. And his arm. Splattered. Taking it hard out here, Commander. Splattered with missiles. Commander. Heading out. Uh, who do we aim for? Well, both the trebuchet and the shadow hawk have got rear damage. Firing. So keep working on the front of the crab. Ah. Oh. Engaging jump jets. I see another delicious rear shot. Oof. It wasn't so deliciously accurate, sadly. The AI is like, I know a good move, I'll hide in the minerals, I'll be safe in the minerals. <laughs> Just like... Show them what you've got. Put a, uh, a total encirclement on them. Reserving action. No, you are not safe in the minerals.
Nice try. This is a mech that uh, really runs quite cool. Oh, nice shooting! And two beautiful LRM-15 systems were placed into the salvage table for us. That Shadowhawk is next. Uh, sorry, it's a Griffin. You're a lizard, Harry! That's what he should have said. <laughs> Standing by. Ugh, I have a rear shot on the crab, and it's not even a shot I really yeah. want to have. Putting one in the back. Nearly. Yes, Commander. Front of the crab. Rear of the Griffin. Let's see how you like this. Oh, that was one hell of a hit. Good to go. I think every part of his mech took some serious heat there. Target confirmed. Okay. Not exciting damage, but it's damage. Extended range SRMs are doing quite well, actually. Ooh. Nearly a penetrating hit there. Time for your story to end. Rear armor is. Noise. Come out with your salad sauce out. We have you surrounded with lettuce. There's so many enemies that there's no point in trying to massage the salvage table in any way. What's up, boss? We will get plenty of good salvage to choose from. Location confirmed. Oh, there goes his arm. Target's taken a critical hit. Waiting for orders. I think we can call this one a done deal. Confirmed. Nice. That was quite that was quite the engagement. But we didn't take any damage. Mission successful. And the appropriate message was was sent. Dun dun. My <laughs> blackjack is just a killing machine. Nice. Plus two accuracy and extended range. And a. Actually, it's pretty light for what it does. 15% for a single ton. The 
This is the inaccurate one that's like a quarter of a ton lighter. I think the hard points on the crab are just not that great. Five energy and two support, that's it. Yeah, not my thing. Not that the Vindicator is much better, considering it's uh, five tons lighter. Oh, whatever. I'll take that fire control. All right, junky medium lasers, sweet. Just what I didn't want. Okay, I need to make a little adjustment to my hunchback. That console is not, it's not worth it for a medium lance. If it doesn't affect the whole lance, it's not worth it. Still a very good piece of kit for a, a heavy or an assault. Who can more afford the two tons it weighs. We have a lot of extra tonnage on the hunchback. But that doesn't mean that we want to waste it. So this would be a uh, uh, definitely a nice piece of kit, but for something heavier. I mean, we're looking at a brawler here, so... Injury, resist, and, and vision, composite HUD would be totally fine. So that frees up two tons. This will be going into a, a heavy or assault in the future that can... has the tonnage to afford it better. You know, I'm actually really tempted to put the AC5 in it now. Two, five, six, seven, eight. The other alternative was to stick a couple of extra heat sinks in it to keep the pain flowing. Let's try it, out of interest. What does that look like? So there's 120 damage right there. It has the bug that it generates no heat, which is amazing. Forty-eight rounds, two, four, six, eight, uh, eight, sixteen, uh, like eight volleys. I want to say. Ten volleys. Ten volleys for a can. That's a brutal amount of firepower. 
I must admit. That would be a brutal amount of firepower to bring to the party. Until it jams. Thirty-two... Sixty... It's actually just blatantly more damage too. <laughs> Despite the, uh, the insane recoil on it. ammo to run the beast. Instability rounds. Okay, standard ammo. That's still some pretty serious firepower we're packing here. And we're not running hot to do it. Hmm, what's the difference here? They both claim to be plus one accuracy extended range. So what's the difference between the two? No clue. They look the same to me. I was just thinking like, can I put an LRM-5 in and like half a ton of LRM ammo? Is that worth it? For an extra 20 damage. Why not? They're not that heavy. Go for the lasers that aren't particularly heavy. Trim. Trim. I know this is going to make some people go crazy, but actually, let's just put it back how it was. <laughs> put it all on one side and make a uh, you know 100% shield arm design. Okay, let's do it. Logged and noted. Shouldn't be too hard. Why not? It's just about got the tonnage to pull it off. Hey, 
boss. We've just completed those upgrades. This is an all ship announcement. There's something very wrong. You are in trouble. God damn. Two million and it's gonna take forty six days. See? That's why you shouldn't let yourself get All right, I'll get the team on it right away. Suckered in with all these cheap upgrades. Four, three, two, one. Okay. Ready to rumble for next time. And while we're at it, let's uh, let's get rid of our panther surplus to requirements. Where's those horrible lasers? There they are. Why would you ever fit a negative weapon? Get out of my inventory. All right, that is it for now. Uh, we got one more straight up battle to do on this planet and then by that time we probably unlock the next story mission but I'm quite happy with my position and I think I'll just carry on with the story missions now. Um, there'll be there'll be opportunities to earn heavies and, and, other, and other mechs but I have a very solid medium lineup here which I'm quite happy with. There's uh, obviously plenty of room for improvement, but we will get there. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time.